Have you ever wondered about traveling faster than light? This fascinating idea has been explored in the concept of warp drives, first proposed by Mexican physicist Miguel Alcubierre in 1994. According to Alcubierre's theory, a spacecraft could seemingly exceed the speed of light by contracting space in front of it and expanding space behind it. However, the catch is this theory relies on creating a modifiable energy density field less than a vacuum or negative mass, which unfortunately is scientifically impossible with our current understanding of physics. But don't lose hope just yet. Recently, there's been a breakthrough. A new warp drive model has been proposed that might just have found a clever workaround. This model maintains a constant speed that is slower than light, yet it satisfies all energy requirements. But what if we told you a new warp drive model might have found a workaround? Enter the new age of warp drive models, one that offers a promising solution for lightning fast traveling. Warp drives have been a fascinating concept since their proposal in the mid 90s, capturing the imagination of researchers and futurists worldwide. Now, a fresh study brings to the fore a warp drive model that operates at a constant speed slower than light, yet meets all energy requirements. This model is a game changer, combining a stable outer layer of matter with a distribution of shift vectors that closely mirrors established warp drive models, such as the Alcubierre metric. This approach provides a solution that is both innovative and rooted in tried and true theoretical foundations. At the helm of this groundbreaking research is Jared Fuchs, a senior scientist at Applied Physics. Fuchs and his team have published their findings in the respected journal Classical and Quantum Gravity, providing a comprehensive insight into this revolutionary warp drive model. But this is not a solo effort. The Advanced Propulsion Laboratory, part of the think tank Applied Physics, has been instrumental in this research. This laboratory, a hub for some of the world's leading physicists, has been delving into the mysteries of warp drives for years. They've been using advanced techniques from the theory of general relativity to manipulate space-time and develop new propulsion methods. The lab's open-source toolbox, the Warp Factory, plays a crucial role in this research. It's designed to simulate the unique physics of warp drives, providing a numerical framework to analyze the physicality of space-time. This approach has led to the development of a warp drive model that complies with general relativity and operates at a constant subluminal speed, all without requiring unphysical forms of matter. This exciting discovery marks a significant first step in understanding what makes practical warp solutions possible. As we delve deeper into the mysteries of space-time and warp drives, we edge closer to a future where lightning-fast traveling is no longer just a concept, but a reality. So, how did they break the warp barrier? The Advanced Propulsion Laboratory at Applied Physics has been at the forefront of warp drive exploration. This think tank, home to some of the world's leading physicists, has been diving into the depths of the warp drive concept, challenging the boundaries of our understanding of space-time. The APL's approach is unique. They utilize advanced techniques from the theory of general relativity to develop new propulsion methods. Rather than relying on brute force or exotic materials, they manipulate space-time itself. Imagine warping the fabric of reality, much like a seamstress alters cloth, to move a spacecraft from one point to another. This is the essence of their research. To bring their theories to life, the APL has developed an open-source toolbox known as the Warp Factory. This isn't your average toolbox, though. It's a complex framework designed to simulate the special physics of warp drives. The Warp Factory provides a numerical playground where scientists can test and analyze the physicality of space-time, giving them a unique perspective on the workings of the universe. The work at the APL has led to a significant breakthrough. They formulated a theoretical method for space travel that complies with general relativity and operates at a constant subluminal speed. In simpler terms, they've created a model for a warp drive that doesn't require the impossible, such as negative mass or energy. Instead, it uses a stable outer layer of matter and a specially designed shift vector, resembling the established warp drive models. This revolutionary model has been dubbed the Constant Velocity Subluminal Warp Drive. It's a game changer. It shows us that warp drives could potentially be more than just a staple of science fiction. They could become a reality. 
What does this mean for warp technology? Well, it's a giant leap towards understanding what makes practical warp solutions possible. It's a breakthrough that could change the way we think about space travel. It's a glimpse into a future where the stars may not be so far away after all. The future of warp technology could be closer than we think. The model leading the charge is the constant velocity subluminal warp drive. This revolutionary model does away with the need for exotic or negative energy sources that were previously thought to be a necessity for warp drive technology. How was this achieved, you ask? The answer lies in a stable outer layer of matter and a modified shift vector. By using this unique combination, the researchers were able to create a warp solution with positive mass. This stabilizing shell was meticulously analyzed and built using Warp Factory, the open source toolbox developed by the Advanced Propulsion Laboratory. This breakthrough is significant. It's the first major stride in understanding what makes practical warp solutions possible. But it's not just about practicality. It's about pushing the boundaries of what we once thought was impossible. This new model of warp drive doesn't just meet the criteria of general relativity, but it also challenges our understanding of space-time itself. The space-time designed for the warp drive is of a novel kind, a kind that surpasses earlier models. This new type of space-time opens up a wealth of opportunities, providing a fresh perspective on the description of space itself. It's like discovering a new language, one that could help us converse with the cosmos in ways we've never imagined. But like any scientific endeavor, there's still much to explore. The team behind this groundbreaking study will continue to investigate how to accelerate the warp drive efficiently without breaking physicality. This remains a major direction of work for the field of warp drive research. So where does this leave us? Well, while we may not be able to time travel today, the possibilities for the future are boundless. As we continue to explore and understand the universe, who knows what could be possible in a few hundred years? The future of warp technology is not just exciting, it's transformative, and it could very well be closer than we think. Our journey into the future of warp technology is just beginning. The new warp drive model, the constant velocity subluminal warp drive, offers a promising solution to the limitations of light speed travel. By combining a stable outer layer of matter with modified shift vectors, this model achieves a warp solution with positive mass opening up the potential for practical warp solutions. The implications for future space travel are profound. The stars might be closer than we think, thanks to the promising solutions offered by the new warp drive model.